No matter how old or young you are, there's always something to learn, learn about our state legislature. And Adrian Oglesby joins us live. Educating everyone in a fun way. Hi, Adrian. In Brooke, I am here with Cheryl Carey and Pipe Resource Center. Yes, and we are here with people playing bingo for a reason. Can you tell me about bingo tonight? <laughs> so we uh, have been doing these bingos for quite a few years now. It's a way for people in the community to learn about civic um, events that are going on and and have fun and win some prizes. All right, and we're up at South Central High School, and this isn't the first one that you guys are gonna be doing, right? Right, we've been doing these bingos for a while. Um, we did it, uh, one specifically for the census to let people be aware of the census. We've done one on the midterm elections, on redistricting. We'll be doing, um, this fall we'll be doing one for the presidential election. So it's just a way to kind of get people information that they need to be civically engaged and in a fun way. And you guys teach as they go, so how does that kind of go? So we play a couple regular games of bingo and then we kind of do a little mini lecture for, you know, five, ten minutes. And then the final bingo is sort of a, a quiz. Um, it's a special card that we make with the answers to the to the questions that we ask or, or to the information that we give during the bingo. So they can kind of test themselves on what they've learned throughout the evening. Well, the event just started, Brooke. I'm going to send it back over to you. You guys can still come out. We're playing bingo for a reason, learning all about this year's legislative session and more. All right, thanks so much, ATO, for that live report.